everyone, welcome to my channel, Tutorial by Sir Raiman. My name is Mr. Jem Raimon Ischen, Master Teacher 2 from Escalante Central Elementary School. Don't forget to click subscribe below to keep updated for my future tutorial. Go forth, rise and shine to us all, Escalante Central Elementary School. You've entrusted us your vision, building your dreams would be our mission. This time, let's talk about mixtures and their characteristics. What is formed when two or more substances like sugar, powder juice, and water are combined? When you combine sugar, powder juice, and water, you form a mixture. Mixtures are combinations of two or more substances. Many of the substances we use every day are mixtures. Most matter also occurs as mixtures. Matter tends to mix naturally, like air, seawater, pebbles, and many more. There are two types of mixture, homogeneous and heterogeneous mixtures. Homogeneous mixtures appear uniform all throughout because they have the same proportion. Homogeneous mixtures are also referred to as, as uniform mixtures. It could be solid, liquid, or gas form. In homogeneous mixture, only one phase is seen or visible after mixing all the components. A mixtures of sugar and water is a homogeneous mixture. When you mix sugar and water, you cannot see the individual parts because the sugar is completely dissolved in water and the granules disappear. Air is an example of homogeneous mixture too. It is composed of oxygen, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, and other particles. Solid particles like dust, pollen, and water vapor are also found in the air but you do not see these gaseous components as separate entities in the air. That is why air is a homogeneous mixture. These are other examples of homogeneous mixture. Salt water, coffee, brass metal, vinegar, and soy sauce. Heterogeneous mixtures are not uniform in proportion or composition, where combined substances are not evenly distributed or mixed. It does not blend throughout. Components are recognizable or remain distinct. Faces or substances are all visible. Heterogeneous mixtures are also called non-uniform mixtures. Soil is an example of heterogeneous mixtures. It is a mixture of sand dirt, rocks, and decayed matter. Sometimes, bits of metals, cloth, glass, and plastic could be found mixed in the soil. Examples of heterogeneous mixtures are fruit salad, Oil with water, pizza, mixed nuts. Milk tea, halo halo,
Minudo. Milk with cereal. And many more. In summary, mixtures are combinations of two or more substances. Mixtures can be homogeneous mixtures and heterogeneous mixtures. Homogeneous mixture is also known as uniform mixture since it appears uniform all throughout because they have the same proportion. These are some examples of homogeneous mixture. Heterogeneous mixtures is also known as non-uniform mixtures since it is not uniform in proportion where combined substances are not evenly spread or mixed. Some examples of heterogeneous mixtures are And that's all about mixtures and its characteristics. Mr. Jem Raimond is 10, Master Teacher 2 of Escalante Central Elementary School, Schools Division of Escalante City. Click like and share if this video tutorial helps you. Don't forget to click subscribe below to keep updated on my future tutorial. For your suggestions, especially on the topic for my next tutorial, please leave your comment below. Thank you so much for watching. Keep safe everyone!